All right, so here we have the adventure of the crooked drawer. Here's the kitchen. You can see how when that drawer pulled out straight, it would hit the, hit the oven door. So the client had to open the oven door every time you want to open the drawer. That's nonsense. Can't have that in your life. So what I did, if you can see back here, the camera kind of gives an optical illusion, but you can see how those are crooked. They're, they're going at an angle. If I go in here, you can see where the, they were mounted straight the first time. And you can see how far we moved them over. That's, I don't know, 15 degrees, something like that. Um, you can only go so far because it starts messing with the, the drawer slides, the way they mount, they can bind. And there's some other geometry going on. And also the way, uh, the way these drawer slides or glides, whatever you guys call them are, uh, they have these clips back there that hold on to the back of the drawer. Well, now the drawer is a little crooked because you can see how they're coming out here. So on the back, I just had to make a little shim to receive that, and no big deal. Uh, the other side, I didn't do it because with a little drawer like this, uh, one was enough. If it was a big wide drawer like that, you'd want to have both of them shimmed out. But this is a little drawer with oven mitts, so it wasn't a big deal. And even if it had heavy stuff in there, it's not going to be really a big deal. So closes and opens, clears the oven. Yay. So everybody's happy. Solution looks a little weird there, right? <laughs> Cause it's crooked, but it works. There you have it. Have a good one.